What is up, everybody? My name is Eric's, and I'm here today to uh, immediately talk about my itchy nose. I'm here today to play Costume Quest and finish the game, hopefully. That's something? Is that a thing? Yeah, it's just candy. Eh, right, whatever. Uh, I think I got a pretty solid strategy. I'm going to be going and using the Yeti to put up armor every turn. And then on the two turns where I have to wait for it to recharge, I have two healers. So I think, as long as I just keep cycling through, everything will be fine. And although I just remembered I forgot to change my battle stamp, so two of my three characters are still trying to do splash damage, which won't mean dick. But, whatever. No big deal. I think I'll be able to get through with this strategy here. I just gotta get through the first few turns and save my abilities. Well, I guess I don't have to save that much. Just use one a turn. That's, that's the overall plan. So it's about how much damage I did last time. Uh, let's see. And I believe after this round, he's going to go and jump up and be... Super defensive and whatnot. There we go. He targeted Everett? Oh, I thought I saw him target Reynolds. Whatever. Okay, so... We'll go ahead and do... A basic attack. I want to get a heal off. As opposed to set up armor in case he targets Everett again. If he targeted... Uh, Reynolds or Ren, then it wouldn't be such an issue, but... That's, that's not always how you get it, you know, so go ahead and do this. Try to heal. Shit, that doesn't heal. Damn it, when he's blocking like that, fuck. Alright, that, that's a bit of a wrench in the gears. Alright. Shit. If they target Everett, I'm fucked again. Alright, good. They, he targeted Reynolds. Oh, piss. Nope, okay, we're fine. Alright, okay, alright, okay, okay, okay! Okay, so he'll hit. Everett will hit. And then Ren will attempt to heal. Which, maybe that's sh how I should have done it in the first place. Because in order to heal, Everett needs to deal damage, which makes sense. I don't think I knew that, but it makes sense because he's a vampire. Are you fucking kidding me with that? Jesus, that was some power, man. Fuck. Alright, well, fuck it. If Ren is down, I mean, I'm not doing this if I can't have all three people. I need all three people. For fuck's sake, man. Alright, let's try this again. But this time, remember to change my battle stamps, because there's no reason to have... Uh, there's no reason to have splash damage. Sane HP recovery per turn. A small recovery per turn for the entire party. Sounds pretty nice, actually. Defense, uh, great, greatly increased critical strike damage, whatever. Large recovery per turn. Insane HP recovery per turn. Okay, so, I think this one and this one with Everett. Everett should probably be healing too. Shit. Um, well, Everett being the vampire is the weakest of the three as far as the, what he brings to the party. Greatly increased HP, kind of whatever. So I think maybe what I want to do is I want to have this one. Okay, let's try this. Let's see how this goes. Too bad I can't skip this scene here. I don't give it. Yeah, he's back. I know. He just kicked my ass twice. Thank you. I'm aware. Grr. Come on. Uh, uh, uh. 
Mashing the A button, cause I don't know what else to do. Just gonna mash the A button, cause I don't know what else to say. Mashing the A button, because I have to watch this whole scene again. I've acknowledged in other videos I'm not much of a singer. I'm not really a singer at all, but that's not gonna stop me from doing it. Yeah, 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 come on. Oh, you can press B and skip it. God damn it. My song is irrelevant. Oh, yeah. Irrelevant, baby. Yeah. Sing about nothing because I can skip the scenes. But I didn't know it because I'm a fool. <sighs> All right. Okay. Here we are. Let's try this again. So, same strategy, except now this time I know once Araxia puts up a shield, Everett's healing is worthless. So, if I need to do some healing, I'm going to start with Ren. I would like to start with Renold. Well, actually, it looks like he was, it was fine. Because Reynolds already back at full health with his battle stamp, so I think maybe that'd be the way to go. Hopefully. I don't want to have to do this again. Yeah, now Reynolds gonna get fully restored again from his battle stamp. Oh, big bones. 186, nice. That's a good amount. Alright. Except I'm not doing a lot of damage. That's unfortunate, but I, I'm, I'm not surprised, so. Yeah, yeah, you and your D&D &D nerd terms. I can call him a nerd. I'm a nerd. Alright. Alright, cool. She can heal on her own. Oh, piss. Alright, good. She lived. And he heals the entire party. She gets 128 back. Alright, that's not so bad. So, BAM! He's still not taking damage. So I'm going to have to use Ren's healing. Which is perfectly fine with me. I have it. You know, I might as well. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Come on. Alright. Almost fully restored. Oh, wrong button. Shit, 250. Okay, well, since Big Bones looks a little active, we're going to go ahead and Abominable Armor. Is it Abominable? Abominable? It's probably Abominable Armor. I'm just dumb in the way I say things. Alright, try to save there's a bat in my hair for next turn at the earliest. Because I can hurt Araxia at the moment. I wonder if I could target Big Bones with it, actually. That'd be mighty helpful. He does his team attack. Not a big deal. He does 50 to 60. 50 to 70, we'll say. Okay, he's going to heal the party. And she's going to get a good chunk. Alright. So Ren is the only one who is has any damage at the moment. I'm not going to look at Everett because fuck it, it's one. One! Not a big deal. I'm only saying that because I know my sister is going to be watching. Hey. My sister's gonna be watching. She's gonna be like, "Actually, um, you, you, you still have you have two characters that don't have full HP." Like, I don't care. It's not a big deal. All right. Ren needs to be healed. That is factual. Big Bones is gonna kill her if I don't. So we'll go ahead and bat my hair, which is kind of what I was figuring that would happen. Okay, so everybody's full health. And I have an anthem ready to go for whenever I need it. Okay. So, it looks like he's gonna be in the air on guard. Yep, Big Bones hits for 250. Yeah. It's kind of a lot. Shit. Alright, 186. 57. I'm not sure that's doing 57 to everybody. 
Oh, is it adding on? Because the stamps kind of move when they when they activate. So maybe it is working. I don't know. All I know is we're going to hit Araxia. And we're going to hit Araxia again. And then Ren is going to Anthem. To close the gap on the HP. Alright. Not, not as much as I would have liked for him. But... And take what you can get. Araxia heals. Probably like 500. I wasn't looking. Hmm. Big Bones back up. Alright, we go ahead and Abominable Armor. Okay. Let's see. I'm not doing a lot of damage to Araxia. It's kind of making me wonder if that's, that battle stamp that was double damage is really that big of a difference. Because uh, I'm not doing a lot here. Then again, he is the final boss. So, I mean, I guess it kind of makes sense. Alright, yeah. Yeah, the middle one activates and they just add it on to whatever the character with the other healing stamp is doing. So, it's working. And burn! There we go. It, it's not a burn, but I'm saying it like it is. Whatever. Who cares? Whatever. Fuck it, right? Yeah! Alright. Shit. I wrong buttoned. Alright. So I don't... I think I'll be okay. Not... Putting up a defense. Because I got... I got Everett can heal. And Ren can use Anthem. So I feel I feel okay not putting up a defense or doing anything. Since Big Bones is currently ready to attack. For 300? Ah, yeah. 314 to Reynold. That's okay. Not a big deal. It's fine. So let's see here. Let's go ahead and attack. 741 HP. It's taking a while. Should be one more round in Araxia goes down. Probably gonna heal himself though. Yeah. Alright, whatever. When Big Bones is up again, let's go ahead and armor. <sighs> it's working so far. I'm about to finish off Araxia. <laughs> ah, come on. That's kind of whatever. They're going to heal themselves anyway. Man, there we go. But Araxia to continuously heal is getting annoying already. Actually, I think I got it this round. This turn. Pretty sure Ren can do that. One left. Yep. Except he should be dead. Why is he dead? Come on! Uh, God damn it. Why? He had 170. I did 185. And he's still alive! What the fuck? Ah! Alright. Try it again. Maybe I have to make Big Bones eat him? I don't know. Because as soon as he hit 1 HP, he jumped up in the air. There we go. This is how you treat your teammates. You use the twin sides. I forgot I was making big bones sound stupid. Oh, okay, and I don't have to fight big bones. All right, nice. The Yeti clapped with his foot. All right, nice. Lucy, 
We're so glad you're safe. Everett, you dismissed all senses of self-preservation to rescue me? Yeah, Ren and Renold aren't there. Well, no scientific advantages have ever been made without a few risks, right? Oh, of course, totally. Observation, that was so brave. Oh. Oh, and look! Candy. Real scientific examples, proof of Big Bone's existence. Great. It's candy, right? So we're just gonna eat it? Can we celebrate on the other side of the portal now? Good idea, because the portal itself is a highly unstable rift in space-time that will soon collapse. So shut up and move! Turning all molecules that pass through it into highly corrosive glo globules of toxic radiation, which... SHUT UP AND MOVE! See? Ren's got the right idea. You should probably do that too. I just wish I could take everything here back with me. Could you guys give me a minute to collect a few more samples? No! You said it could collapse. Let's fucking go! Sorry in advance, Lucy, but this is for everyone's well-being. Good call. Push your ass through. Uh, guys? Now what? Fascinating. Where the hell am I? I don't remember this. You just ended like that? What the fucking fuck? That's gotta be for Costume Quest 2. I don't remember that ending at all. Uh, really? Alright, well, I guess it's gotta be on the next Costume Quest. And I'm not saying that like my Atra, I'm saying that like in Costume Quest number 2. So, yeah, uh, I am unfortunately not gonna be able to play the second one without it bleeding over into November, even with uh, putting up two videos every day, so... I know I talked about wanting to play it, and I do want to play it, I've never played Costume Quest 2 before, but... I really feel like it'd be awkward to be playing a Halloween-themed game all the way up into, I don't know, November 10th or whatever, however long it takes. So, I'm just going to kind of stop with this one and just Costume Quest 1 for this month. So, apologies guys, I was looking forward to playing it, I really was. But, uh, they dress up their dogs too. I never understood that. But, yeah, anyway, thank you guys for watching me all the way through Costume Quest 1. I hope you enjoyed it. We can go ahead and stop that credits there. and Just because we ain't going to see them all anyway. So thank you guys for watching. And I will see you all in the next video. Whatever that may be. I'm currently playing uh, Pokemon Uranium and Paper Mario. So, well, actually Paper Mario just ended. So check them out. Check out Pokemon Uranium if you're a fan of Pokemon. Thank you guys for watching. I will see you all in the next video.